everyone, this is Daniel Scranton, and Kaliandra's here, <laughs> and we're going to channel the Arcturian Council. E <laughs> oh. without having to take action to do so. We are of service to all of you, even though we have no physical bodies with which to take action. Therefore, when you are seeking to be of service to your fellow humans, please recognize that you don't have to know what action will be of greatest service in order to help. We often see you stumbling in regards to your service work because of that uncertainty, 
because you don't know what to do. And when you question yourselves and whether anything you could do would help, you stifle that energy. You stop yourselves from allowing the energy of service to flow to you and through you. You do have the ability to help all of humanity. while sitting alone in the dark in a corner in your home. Because you have the power of intention. You have the power of focus. You have the power to raise your vibration. You have the power to visualize and hold space. You have so many powers that go so far beyond what you could actually do with your physical bodies. And, as we have said, We are the examples to you of how it is done, how this can be accomplished without so much as lifting a finger. Now, we also recognize that there are ways of taking action to be of service and we know that there are heroes on your world who are taking actions every single day to help others Those individuals have a specific calling. They know what that calling is and they enjoy following through with the actions that they take. But there are many more of you whose job it is to work in the ethereal realm, to work with energy, consciousness, vibration, intent, and to come together as a collective of light workers to help humanity heal, evolve, and become the fifth dimensional collective that you are destined to become. You are receiving this message right now because you are in that collective of light workers. You are making a difference with all that you do internally to help shift the consciousness of all humans, all beings that exist on your world. And again, look to us for reassurance of this truth when you are in doubt. Know that we are non-physical beings.
and therefore all of our help comes from our vibration, our intention, and our ability to focus. Join us and become part of a galactic team of light workers. As we all seek to work together to help humanity at this very significant time in your history. Well, the Octarian Council, and we have enjoyed connecting with you. Oh. <laughs> I'm just bathing. <laughs> you pick funny times to bathe in the middle of the video, Kaliandra. <laughs> oh, thank you everybody for watching this video. This is Kaliandra the cat. I'm Daniel Scranton, the channel. And uh, I uh, had a really nice day today. Day off. Spent some uh, beautiful uh, time at the beach with my wife and daughter. It was a less windy day than usual there. Uh, we've, had, we've had a lot of windy days at the beach lately. And today it was nice, and uh, we spent uh, over two hours there. It was really nice. Um, I feel like there was uh, so much I wanted to say to you guys, and now I don't remember what it is. Oh, here comes the lizard. The lizard just popped onto the screen as I said that. <laughs> uh Oh, I got another B vitamin shot today. Oh, and I noticed also like what a huge difference it made for me today to meditate when I couldn't sleep this morning. So I've been waking up a lot after like seven hours instead of eight. You know, I like to get eight hours. That's, that's a number that feels, I feel best when I sleep that many hours. So lately I've just been getting like seven or even less than seven. And this morning I just said, I'm just going to meditate like I do before I channel and get my energy up again in that way. And I, I had such a great day and I feel like it's because I took that time to meditate. Um, so... I, there was something else I want. Oh, uh, I started. Oh, yeah. I started to try to watch Brave New World on the Peacock uh, streaming network. It was bad. Sorry. I mean, maybe it's good if you stick with it for all the episodes. But, um, yeah, I just, I just, uh, I did not get a good, did not get a good feel for it. Um, and it's too bad, too, because that's a great book. One of those books they make you read in high school, but you actually enjoy, like Catcher in the Rye. Um, and written by uh, the guy uh, who used to hang out with Timothy Leary and Ram Dass. Ram Dass of uh, former Maui resident Ram Dass. <laughs> he just left the earth plane. Um, yeah, so uh, back to the Americans till I find something better. Americans is good. I mean, it's obvious that they're they're showing that these characters are going to evolve, and and it's interesting because the characters believe so much in the cause. You know, they 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 feel like they want what's best for everyone. That that is you know what is at the heart of 
what Karl Marx wanted and what communism was supposed to be about. And so they're, they're idealists, but they're also murdering people. <laughs> as the as the uh, the means and so it's hard sometimes to watch uh, people do that even though they believe in what they're doing um, and but it's a, but it's a good show it's well done I, that's the thing about brave new world I just didn't I just don't feel like it's well done it's got a good premise it's set in the future which I like I love sci-fi but I just don't feel like they're they're doing a good job with all the source material they have. Um, Call Andrew, you know what I'm talking about. You know. Uh, I'm trying to think of like a, a Talea moment to share with you guys today from today. I mean, we spent a lot of time in the hammock on the beach, and um, just a lot of time today in general with her, which is great. Which is such time well spent um, she's doing great I, I appreciate all the the gifts again for her birthday which was this week and um, they're still coming in we're, we're just so thankful to all of you um, yeah and uh, another day off tomorrow so that's exciting back to the beach back to the beach tomorrow and the forest and more food getting <laughs> tomorrow we go to our farm our, our local farm here where the chef chef larry they call him he's making me raw crackers as in addition to the raw macadamia nut cheese so that's exciting uh something new tomorrow and uh that's about it I, uh, I thank you once again, as always, for watching. I know a lot of you watch these right to the very end because you tell me before I do sessions with people. And I just I think it's really sweet that you care about uh, my life and my family and what's going on here and Kaliandra. Of course, everybody loves Kaliandra. <laughs> um, so uh, I appreciate you all, whether you're on YouTube or Instagram watching this. If you're on YouTube, lots of links. I got classes, courses, other stuff down below in the, in the links uh, in the description. And uh, if you're on Instagram, tell someone else about me, please. <laughs> I have very few followers and views. On Instagram and if you're on YouTube watching this and you have an Instagram account just go find me uh, Daniel Scranton channels and uh, start following me on there appreciate it I love you guys blessings bye see you tomorrow subscribe hit the subscribe button <laughs>